I'm a senior at Omaha Central. This poem is for anyone who has ever heard the word perfection and thought it sounded like safety. Thought it looked like all of your hopes, gift wrapped, delivered, a solution to your everything. This poem is for anyone who has ever heard the word flawless, saw sacred, heard ugly, saw evil. This poem is for anyone who has ever, who has ever changed themselves to be what was expected. For anyone who has ever changed themselves Praising pretty like it was measured in pounds, looking for something to make themselves whole, but finding nothing holy here. This poem is for anyone tired of thinking that if they remind themselves enough what beauty is, maybe one day they'll feel worthy of it. Tired of hearing about expectations set for them by someone else. For anyone tired of following a false religion. I wonder what would happen if we gathered a new congregation. If we sparked a revolution like fire within ourselves, if we used hands and words like torches and burned down this church and built something better from its ashes, rearranged lumber and stained glass into something finally holy, something beautiful that is finally worthy of all of us. And I wonder what would happen if our flames spread like wildfire, if classrooms became pulpits where every child was taught to always love themselves, where every raised hand was a silent hallelujah, where boys weren't taught to be emotionless shells raised in mud and rough hands, girls were not packaged porcelain wrapped in lace and a polite smile. What if crowded streets were revivals, where everyone was reborn through the praise of others? <coughs> Words like river water, laughter hymnals, everyone baptized in the glowing eyes of another. What if every moment was filled with the proclamation of belief in yourself? This poem is a reminder that our bodies are not mirrors that reflect the brilliance inside of us. If they were, we would all be walking spotlights. Lighthouses for anyone trying to find themselves. This poem is a reminder that we are made of drawers. Everything we love, everything we are tucked safely inside of us. This poem is a reminder that you are your own sacrament, your body, your blood, holy holding something sacred inside you, you were a constant reminder of your covenant to always love yourself, even when they might not want you to. You're starting a reformation that makes perfection sacrilegious, scrawling the word ugly across walls and in textbooks, letting everyone know that we don't want their beauty if it is defined for us. We are reading wrinkles and scars like lines of scripture. Every day we smile is the Sabbath, and we are the only ones capable of judging ourselves because we don't want to be what is expected of us anymore. This poem, this prayer, is for all of us.